Hello there, thanks as always for joining me, in this case to look inside my gig box for May 2021. Now this did have a uh, just a plain brown box around the side protecting it, I've taken it off there and you see a very small box left behind compared to the size my gig box often is. It's still it's um, light to medium weight, let's not waste too long though thinking about the outside, let's look more at what's inside there. Oh, we've got a bit of packaging and we have three or four more items afterwards. Let's go for the big one. The big one being, uh, even I can tell, this is the Flash. This is, this is huge compared to the size of the box. DC Comics, nice design, that traditional red superhero outfit from, oh, it's a Batman universe. Officially, it's a collector's bust. Who knows what makes um, something a bust, a vinyl, a collectible, a figure, or what else? Does it say anything useful on the back? Made in London in the, the UK, Eagle Moss Collections. Eagle Moss do a lot of these. Build up your collection month by month of different items. But I do, I like this one. This would display really well there. So we've got the flash to start up. And I've got a bit of a feeling to go a bit downhill from here, looking at what's here, especially if that's not one, but two collectible coins there. Um, let's see what they are. Well, let's let's do the, the first one. Let's do some Star Wars Ewok Wicket. Um, you may just be able to make that out. It looks um, quite a nice design as coins go. It is limited edition number 940 of 1000. So that's quite a low number as collectible coins go. So I guess that makes it a bit more collectible. Nice Star Wars logo on the back. Uh, not a toy as it mentions. Another one made in the UK. Tomato Sauce Limited, well probably not made in the UK, but um, released in the UK. But yeah, I think probably Bristol for anyone who knows the UK over in the, the west of England there. Uh, yeah, ni nice enough coin. Don't know much more to say about that, so let's move on to a second coin, which thankfully is a different collection. This is Marvel's Avengers, 932 out of a thousand. So another one towards the end of that very limited number. This is the Hulk. Uh, not the highest definition on a coin, really, to make out the Hulk, but you can definitely see it is him. This is a 38mm uh, antique gold commemorative. I suspect not real gold, otherwise it will be worth far more than the, the box itself, but gold styled. Again, you've got the nice Avengers logo on the back. This is from the Coin Club. Don't know much about the Coin Club, but I wouldn't be surprised if it's the same company as the previous coin, although the previous coin gives a a different version, but it just, just seems like the kind of thing that should be related. And you've got one from Marvel, one from Disney, which is also Marvel nowadays. So there we have two coins there. Very nice, as they go. And finally, we're going to move on to a Toy Story 4 keyring or keychain, as as we call it, from Cos Baby. Interesting company, or what is it Cos Baby there? Or is it um, Hat Toys? Who knows? But what can we say about Buzz here? Um, not to have quite a lot of Chinese writing on the bottom. We don't always see that. It suggests where it may have been manufactured, like so many of these things, which were made in Dong Kongjuan, China. There. Um, yeah, nice enough, but um, not my favourite keychain. Keychains are never my favourite in the first place, but I've had far worse there than that one. So, I don't know, a little bit. I always find these coins a bit disappointing, although it's nice to have ones with very limited numbers in there. But let's run through what we've got again. We've got the keychain, the, the two coins, the Hulk and the Ewok Wicket. And then finally, the interesting item, which is this collectible bust of, of the Flash, looking a quite distanced, really focused up towards, well, in my case, the ceiling, but I guess towards whatever is going on. Doesn't look like he's about to, to pace off does he in that particular model. But thanks for watching, this was my geek box. This was the, the May 2021 My Geek Box. As always, do look at geeksofcrutionbox.com. You'll find out about a lot more of the geek boxes available in the UK and around the world. And you'll get my value assessment of this one to work out, is this worth the money for the subscription? But um, very, ni very nice model in here amongst other geek items. Speak to you later.